Hi, I'm David Sanders, and I'm an editor at JOS, the Journal of Open Source Software. And I'm going to talk about publishing your research code in JOS, where open source meets bot-assisted academic peer review. We in this community all know that software is important, and it's also everywhere. Here's a nice quote from Gael Varoko, the creator of Scikit-Learn. Software turns a theoretical model into quantitative predictions. Software controls an experiment, and software extracts from raw data evidence supporting or rejecting a theory. In other words, software is really key to the scientific process. But software is not a creditable research activity. Writing research software is not rewarded by the academic system. So how can we better recognize software contributions? We need to find a way to fit software into the current system, which is paper and book centric. And then we need to evolve beyond this one dimensional credit model. So how can we do that? Well, we need to develop mechanisms for software citation, make software somehow citable and make it easy for people to cite the software. The idea of the Journal of Open Source Software is to make this as painless as possible by just writing papers about the software. Software papers give us something that is easy to cite. It requires no changes to the existing publishing infrastructure and publishing software papers actually raises the profile of software within a given community. And so that is what JOS is about, making it as easy as possible to write and publish a software paper. How can we do that? So JOS is a developer-friendly journal for research software packages. Preparing and submitting your paper, provided it's well-documented and tested, should take no more than an hour. And the main purpose of a JOS paper is to enable citation credit to be given to authors of research software. A paper should be short around two pages, it should describe the high-level functionality and the purpose of the software aimed at a diverse, non-specialist audience. It has a statement of need that illustrates where the software can be applied in actual research applications and contains references to results that use the software, but it does not contain actual novel scientific results. It's about the software artifact. And the goals are providing a valuable service to authors while leveraging the best parts of open source. And this is done by a constructive, totally open peer review process on GitHub led by research software experts, which is focused on improving the submission itself, not on rejecting the paper. And this is achieved by actually reviewing the software. Is it well documented? Is it well tested? We have transparent and achievable review criteria, and it's totally open access with no publishing charge. And the main way that this is achieved is by automating as much as possible using robots or bots to automate the labor intensive tasks. JOS has had quadratic growth in the last few years. We published our 1000th paper last year and this year we're projecting 500 papers being published. It's really explosive growth that illustrates that this fills a gap in the, in the market. So here's an example interaction on GitHub with the editorial bot. It detects the programming language of a submission. It automatically compiles the paper. The editors can send commands to this bot to automate the mundane editorial tasks that otherwise take up a lot of time. And here we see that issues that are opened on the software repository can be mirrored to the review issue itself. There are already several papers published about Julia in JOS. You can see that there's now 1300 papers published altogether and quite a few of those are about Julia packages. Here's an example paper, the Dr. Watson package by George Datseris et al. So JOS really is an open collaboration between the author, the editor, and the reviewers. So if you have a package with research code, please feel free to submit a paper to JOS. And we're also actively recruiting editors to fulfill the needs of this rapidly growing population of authors who want to publish in JOS. So please do apply to be an editor as well if you think that you can help us. Okay, thanks for your attention.